Mass spectrometer. How do chemists find the mass of each isotope? They use this mass spectrometer. And what it is, it's a powerful instrument that generates a magnetic field to obtain data about the mass and abundance of atoms and molecules. Okay? You can use the data obtained with the mass spectrometer to calculate the average atomic mass given in a periodic table. We don't have one of these. Okay. So, but using that was how they were able to, to, to decipher the fact that carbon makes up 98.9%. Okay, so using that mass spectrometer, they were able to get this value. They were able to get this value. They were able to decipher that that was what was left. Okay. So calculating average atomic mass. Lithium exists as two isotopes, lithium-7 and lithium-6. Okay. Lithium-7 has a mass of 7.015 U okay, and makes up 92.58% of lithium. Lithium-6 has a mass of 6.015 U and makes up the remaining 7.42%. But according to our periodic table, what is the mass of lithium? 6.9. Print, 6.9? Yeah. It's 6.941. 6.941, right? So, which one of these is our typical lithium according to our periodic table? Lithium 7. Lithium 7, right? So, we have a lithium 7 isotope, we have a lithium 6. But notice the, the atomic masses of both of them. Do they equal the atomic mass that we have in the periodic table? No, because that's the one she gave us, 6.941. Okay. So how do we figure that out? Well, we take this value. Okay. So we take our lithium. We take our lithium seven. Okay. And we, what we do is, well, we take the um, the percentage. So we want to convert 92.58 percent. So we're going to divide it by. 100 to get rid of the percent sign, and we get 0 0.9258. So we're going to take that value, 0 0.9258, right? and we're going to find what percentage of that mass is actually of that actual atomic mass. So what we're trying to do, think back to elementary math when you're asked to find percent of a number. Find 5% of 20. So what you're trying to do is, you're trying to find 92.58% of this mass. You're gonna try to find the remaining 7.42% of 6.015. Units. Okay? So what we have here, so again, 7.42 divided by 100 equals 0 0.0742. So remember, percentages, we always change to a, to a decimal by dividing by 100. So we get 0. Uh, sorry, 0 0.0742 times 6.015. Okay. So all we're doing is we're trying to find a percentage of a number. What's that number? The atomic mass of that isotope. We want to find 92.58% of this atomic mass. We want to find 7.42% of this atomic mass. And then we want to combine them. Okay. So what do we get? We multiply... Right? Did you add all of them, or is it just from that the top one? Well, if you add them, you just add them multiply. Ultimately, yeah. So, what was the, the this top one? That top one was six point four nine four. Six point four nine four. Okay, and then it continues. Yeah. So we just we need our least number of significant digits. Or let's say, well, three, but we'll worry about that um, later. 
Then we multiply the bottom one. And what do we get? Zero point. What'd you get? Oh, I didn't Zero point four four six. So add those two values. Add these two values. Yes, a calculator would be great. <laughs> Great tool. It says 6.936. Okay, so 6.936. Right? So look at this value here. It's the closest to the actual value in the periodic table. Okay? Of course, maybe if we took all these digits, we would have gotten even closer to that value. But because we already rounded off our numbers, Okay, when before we added them, that we didn't get as accurate of a value. Okay, so if we were taking the least number of significant digits is three, so the value is 6.94U. So notice how, well, the lithium that we know of, really, look at, that's the atomic mass. It's not the 6.94. That 6.94, in fact, was an average atomic mass. It's an average atomic mass of all the different, um, you know, of all the different isotopes, the seven and the six. Okay. So, which one do you think we have in in most of them? Notice here the percentage: ninety-two point five eight percent is made up of the larger atomic mass. So that's why our real answer. Look at where it's closer to. It's closer to the seven point zero one five than it is to the. 6.015 atomic mass number. Okay, because a greater percentage is of that higher, okay, of that isotope. 